ha, 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 ha. All right. So, guys, I am super excited about this Tabata today because we're going to be doing all my favorite exercises in this Tabata. And we have a couple new ones. But if the new ones you don't feel comfortable with, I will definitely give you substitutions. So don't, don't worry about it, all right? But um, in the meantime, let me give each one of you mats and bands. We're gonna do different bands today. Now, if you don't have a, if you don't have a mini band at home, that's fine. Um, we'll, we'll, I'll give substitutions for that too. But so, story of the day is not really a story. What it is, is a wish. And my wish and Josh's wish is that I think, I think one of the things that I, I've learned most importantly through this, in, this entire like four year adventure has been when we started the quarantine challenge and how we had that list of things to do for the challenge, but it's the list of things that we need to be doing every day. You know, like at Training for Warriors, we have water month where we're, we're watching our water, or we have meditation month, or we have gratitude month. But it's like all of those things should be making up our day. Not should, but they, they need to be making up our day in order to make us the healthiest people possible. So guys, our wish for you is that you keep working out, you know? Keep doing the thing. Like even if it's like three days a week, get that, get that scheduled in, right? Get, do that for yourself. Eat those meals, drink that water. It's so, so important because all we wish for you is that you be your healthiest, happiest self. And, and just either take with you the lessons that we've had at Training for Warriors or the lessons that you've already known, but we're just, you know, re, like really getting that smooshed into your head, you know? And also, like, we're gonna keep the Facebook secret group up and we wanna make sure that, like, if you're going and checking out another gym, go ahead and put that on the secret group so that you can tell people like, okay, this is my experience at this gym. These guys are really cool. This is what they're doing there. Use that as a way to like motivate each other to keep being healthy because that's what, that's what this is all about, right? Is to be our ha happiest, healthiest selves, all right? So that's just our wish for you guys. And um, it was so funny. Sarah and Catling, you guys were cracking me up last night. On, on, the, on the warrior windows, we put up um, everybody's gratitudes um, that they've filled out, and, and I've taped them up on the window, and um, there's jumping jacks on there. And Sarah was like, who put jumping jacks on here? And it's like, I did. I like jumping jacks. So we're going to do those now, guys. All right. I'm going to count the first five. You're going to count the second five. And go. One, two. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Second set, trouble. You just have trouble written all over your face. Second set, here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And go. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Last set. First set. Nice. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. There you go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. There you go. One. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Awesome, guys. Let's go ahead and grab some water before we start. And just keep drinking coffee and see what happens. You know what? I do the same thing. <laughs> Let's start on the floor. 
Let's start on the floor. What we're gonna do is some hip circles. So knee to elbow, leg out to side, up and back and down. Go ahead, give me five that direction and then switch it around the other way. So guys, we got a special treat this morning. I got my 6 p.m.ers in our morning class, which uh, I don't know if you guys know this, but the 6 p.m. class is the loopiest and um, usually the craziest. It's like a bunch of monkeys in here hanging from the rig and stuff. So five circles in the one direction and then switch it out to the other direction. Then take it to the other leg. Got to the toes. Yeah, exactly. Woo, man, I'm feeling that today. How about you, Bob? Great. You love hip circles. Good <laughs> All right, guys, go back to that original leg and give me fire hydrants. Just five. Keeping that hip down. It's not a big movement. I want you to feel that in your glutes. All right. High kneeling position. Clasps our hands and rotating our wrists. <laughs> Morning, Catlin. I don't even know what I'm looking at right now. This is so hilarious. Oh my God, this is killing me. <laughs> I thought you were a nocturnal animal. All right, <laughs> all right, take it back the other way. <laughs> there might be less trouble in the morning. Oh, less trouble in the morning, all right. Chin to chest, air to shoulder, take it around. Take it slow, guys. Be gentle with those necks. Even though we're just doing mobility, go ahead and get those glutes on. Five circles that way, and then five circles the other. Heather's representing with her TFW shirt. I love it. Nice. Great. Oh, yeah. Cossack stretch because, guys, it's my favorite. I love it. Rocking forward and back, forward and back 10 times, and then five leg lifts. Yeah. Oops, I forgot to put music on like I always do. Alexa, play Girl Talk Radio. In class, no. well, it's hard be on the video because I'm I'm mic'd, yeah. so it like these guys can hear you, but like the uh, the other the other folks can't. Oh, that's nice. Yeah. Never class, really. But you can't hear me. Yeah. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. Nice job, guys, with those leg lifts. All right, cat cow, cat cow. So I'm in my quadruped position leading with my tailbone coming up feeling those shoulder blades really pull up to the ceiling and then taking it the other way starting with my tailbone finish with my head go ahead and give me five each way oh feeling all the feels this morning guys No, it is not your last workout. <laughs> She's missed, she missed the wish. God damn it. <laughs> All right. Then side lying archer. Don't nobody fall asleep during this. Then we're going to stack our knees, reaching out. I want you to follow that hand, that, that hand with your eyes coming back in. Woo. 
it's something when that's intense in the morning, you know? It's like, oh God, what's in store for me today? Oh yeah, totally. Yeah. I was like dead yesterday. I was like, I just need to lay down. Poor Catlin, she did the same workout twice. I bet. Go to the other side, keeping those knees stacked. Oh. Taking it slow, trying to get that shoulder as close to the ground as possible. Ow! <laughs> Grab my skin. <laughs> I was like, it pinched me. All right. So now, guys, we're going to go into our pigeon. Our pigeon. All right. So we're going to go into a high plank. I want to bring my knee in between my hands. I'm going to keep that back leg straight and really active. And then I'm going to breathe into this. All right. So as a special treat, we're going to be doing a variation of this in the Tabata. It's going to be fun. It's going to be fun. <laughs> you are. That looks good. Good job. That's it. Just that's it. Just trying. Yeah. Maybe. Maybe. <laughs> ah, ah. All right. Switching it out the other side. You got it. Oh my God. That side's lower. Good job. Yeah. All right, switch it out one more time, each side. Oh, wow. Feeling the feels. Oh, let's do it again, again. All right, standing it up as soon as you're done. All right, guys, let's do some alphabets. Alphabets, let's start with our eyes. Coming into that hinge position, really bringing that butt to the back wall, biceps go next to ears, and then going into that ski jumper position with those arms, getting those arms up as high as you can in the back. There you go, Bob, there it is. Yeah, you guys should really feel this in your hamstrings. Whee, give me five on each side. I'm sorry, five total. <laughs> Count, counting, counting. All right, now let's go into our W. So forearms together, hands together. My hands are at my face because that's gonna help line up my hands at my shoulders when I squeeze my shoulder blades at the back. Get that book to close and then book to open. Five of those. Nice, next, I'm gonna go into my Ys. In that same position, arms at a 45 degree angle and then just touch the knees, 45. I want you to take it slow, guys. I want a nice pause at the top and then come back down. Pause at the top and come back down. Now, if you're ever doing a workout snack and you wanna do these, do some high reps with no weight. You're gonna feel it, right? All right, then our last one is our T's. So, coming directly out to the side, squeeze those shoulder blades, pause at the top, come back down. Squeeze those shoulder blades, boom. Ah. Ah. All right. All right, guys, so next, we're gonna come into our deep, deep, deep squat. I'm gonna grab my toes, I'm gonna rotate, rotate, then lengthen those legs, chin to chest. Feel that stretch in the hamstrings. Come back down. Rotate, rotate, chin to chest. All right, give me five total, taking your time. <laughs> what is this, Catlin? What number are we on? Uh, five. This is five? Okay. 
All right. Ah. <laughs> it's like, no, don't make me count, too. All right, guys, now we're going to go into a wide, wide stance. I want to come into that side lunge, hands next to foot. I'm going to walk it out into a high plank, walk it back in, and then I'm going to rotate. So stay in that deep lunge as you're going from side to side. Oh. Go ahead, give me five on each side, getting those shoulders warmed up, getting that groin warmed up. I like that. That's a good one. Circus theme. Oh. Did my music turn off? Yeah. Oh, man. Chris, can you yell at Alexa to play Girl Talk Radio? Alexa, <laughs> play Girl Talk Radio! Do it. She doesn't like me. Alexa. Oh, she did it. She did it. She did it. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Five on each side, guys. Now she's just talking. Oh, no. Oh, no. Now she's going to play pink because she's just going to. All right. So, guys, now what we're going to do as far as our warm-up is concerned is we're going to go through each one of these exercises. Now, I'm going to throw in some new exercises that we haven't done before. If they don't feel comfortable to you, then I'm going to give you substitutions, all right? So it's, it's no big deal. But we're not starting the Tabata yet. I want to make sure that we're all set up and all good to go for these different exercises. So <laughs> this first one is called a tabletop bear crawl turn flip. I don't know what the heck it is, but we, this is what it looks like. Now, you can choose to do this or not. <laughs> so I'm here. I'm going to flip over. I'm going to flip over. I'm going to do a bear crawl or a mammalian crawl. And then I'm going to flip over, flip over, and then I'm going to go backwards. All right? Now, if you're not doing that, you can do a, a sit out or you can do a dead bug. All right? So those are the three things. So we're doing a progression. We're, we're, the harder one of this is going to be the flip over, flip over, walk, walk, flip over, flip over, walk backwards, walk backwards. All right? So give me, you want to do dead bugs? Yeah. Okay, do dead bugs. But do it now, Sarah, as part of your warm-up. Oh. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's like, don't, don't watch everybody. Do the thing. <laughs> All right? How does that feel, guys? Right? Yeah. It's, it's fun, right? It's fun. Yeah. yeah. I don't know where I am. <laughs> yeah, try to straighten out those legs, Heather, with those dead bugs. All right? Yeah. Okay, guys. Then... The walking pigeon. Oh my God. So we're already going to be on the ground. This is going to be the other thing with this, with this exercise. So for my walking pigeon, I'm going to come in. I'm going to bring that back leg to the ground. And then I'm going to bring my arms up in the back. I'm going to switch it out. Come in. Ka -ka. Ka -ka. Um, this one for dogs. Yeah, so guys, if you're not doing the walking pigeon, you're gonna do, I'm sorry, a bird dog. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> opposite arm, opposite leg reaches out. All right. Yeah, nice. Yeah, I'm, I'm getting as low as I can because my back leg is also on the ground for this one. Nice, Bob. Look at that mobility, Bob. Who are you? <laughs> oh, I don't know. All right, give me one more on each side. How's that feel, guys? <laughs> All right. Great job, guys. So then I'm going to I'm going to tell you the progression for this one. So you're either going to do a prisoner squat, which is the first level of the progression. The second level of the progression would be a squat jump. The third level 
would be to put a band, that, this, this is an extra large mini band, You're gonna put it above your knees, You're gonna come into your squat and jump, keeping those legs out as you do it, all right? So, let's go ahead and give me five prisoner squats, five jumps, or five banded jumps. There you go, there you go. So bring it down a little bit, Catelyn. Okay. Yeah, I don't know. It's not, it's not underwear. <laughs> there you go, yeah. And then explode out, yeah. And then ninja, ninja soft landing. Yeah. Can I just do baby jumps? Yeah, you can also do just, just squats with the band. Totally, yeah. All right, guys. Then I want you to keep your bands on if you're gonna use the bands for that, because then we're gonna to go to the ground, we're gonna do our glute bridge press. So I want you to push out on those knees as you bring those hips up to the ceiling, and then you're gonna press your dumbbells up as you're squeezing your shoulder blades, all right? So you're gonna have that really nice tension on your legs. Go ahead and give me 10. Hips up, Reba. Hips up. Hips up. Ah, hey, hey, hey. There you go. Nice. Good job, guys. It's a thing, right? It's a thing. Yeah, yeah. So that's, that's the coupling of those two exercises, all right? That's going to be the banded squat jumps and then the glute bridge press. All right, so yeah, good point, Jennifer. If you're not doing the jumps, but you do have a mini band, you can still just do the, the squats with it. You don't, need to, you don't need to jump with it. Then guys, what we're gonna do is our Arnold, I'm sorry, our calf raises. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna take my weight, I'm gonna come up on my toes. I wanna really think about that big toe and locking out those legs and locking out those glutes. And then I'm gonna rock. So I wanna rock on my heels and then come back up again. Rock on my heels, come back up. Go ahead and give me 10 of those. What? Okay, so that, Bob, that's not helpful. <laughs> that's fall over? All right. 10 of those. And then. Sledgehammer. Gabriel on repeat. All right, guys, then Arnold presses. So my elbows are in, coming out, up, and down. Now with this Arnold press, we're getting more mobility with it. The other way to do an Arnold press is to have your elbows up, and then that's more strength. But I'd like you to get the mobility by getting those elbows down to your ribs. There we go, 10 of those. So hopefully you're feeling that your weight is a adequate <laughs> choice. <laughs> Hey, I didn't make you do the uh, banded uh, oh presses yesterday. You just did the RDL, so you should be okay, Catelyn. No, I All right. <laughs> I love it. I love it. All right. So then, guys, we're going to do either the, the progression for this is going to be a, either an inchworm coming out into a high plank, coming back in, I want you to get your legs as straight as possible. So if you need to like really widen out those legs, that's fine. The next part of the progression for this would be a single leg walkout. So I'm gonna bring my leg up. I wanna get down as far as I can with that bent knee. Then I'm gonna walk it out and come back in. And then I'm gonna switch it out. All right, so stay low on the way out, stay low on the way in and come back up. So either inchworm or single leg walkout. Go ahead, give me five on each side. Very nice, good job with that plank. That plank, guys, at the top is really important. I want you to get your butt at the same level as your shoulders. Getting those shoulders over those wrists. Five on each side. So maybe when you're doing the Tabata, you might only get a time to do right, left, right. The next time you hit it, maybe start with left, right, left, just to make sure you're staying even with that, all right? 
Nice, Bob. Ah. Here we go. Good job, guys. Nice, Heather. I can only see Steve stealing. That's okay. <laughs> All right. Then we have our sumo bent row. So I'm gonna have my legs out a little bit wider than I normally would. I'm gonna come down. I'm gonna be in this really wide squat. I'm gonna go into a single arm bent row, but with this other arm, I'm pushing down into the ground, and then I'm coming up. Pushing down into the ground, pulling up, taking it either side. Go ahead and give me five on each side. Trying to keep that butt down. There we go. I call this milking the upside down cow. The pants are falling down. The pants are falling down. You losing, losing body fat, Jennifer? No, I'm just falling about fat. <laughs> All right, guys, then we have our body saws. My other favorite. Ah, I know, isn't that crazy? It's so crazy, Sarah. So I'm gonna come into this plank and then I'm gonna push back. So I want my elbow, my shoulders to be beyond my elbows and then I'm gonna push forward and I want my shoulders to be in front of my elbows. But I wanna keep my butt at the same level each time. So when I'm forward, I'm on my toes. When I'm backwards, I'm getting my really nice ankle flexion with that, coming in and out. In and out. Give me 10 times. We did these live class feet, didn't we? Probably. Yeah. Butt down, Jennifer. It's, 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 it's the shape of it. <laughs> it's not the shape of it, it's raised up. <laughs> Jennifer's physiology is different from everybody else's, which okay. is true, which is true. But have, you don't have a five foot tall butt, so. I have the best butt friends. <laughs> we actually met. Oh. Very tall, my friends. Wow. Oh my God. Oh my God. See, this is what happens when you invite the 6 a.m.ers, I'm sorry, 6 p.m.ers to a morning class. We talk about butt cracks and, all right. So now we're gonna do our military crunch. You wanna make it harder, you're gonna grab a dumbbell. Knees are bent the entire time. Coming up at the top, there we go, and back down. Go ahead and give me 10 of those. Ugh. Yeah. Real, full extension with those arms, guys, when you're coming up and then when it's back. Ah. Ah. Yay. And that's all the exercises in the circuit, right? So you have a medley, a medley of stuff to pick from. So before we start each circuit, I'll make sure that I remind you what the progression is and then you can choose which, which way you're gonna go. Let's grab some water. I'm gonna... Tabatas are 20 seconds of work, 10 seconds of rest for four minutes. We're just gonna do two exercises each circuit. So for my first circuit, I have that tabletop turn with bear crawl. So that's flipping over, flipping over, Crawl, crawl, flipping over, flipping over, crawl backwards, crawl backwards. Or you're gonna be doing your dead bugs. Or you're gonna be doing sit outs. All right. So those are your three choices for that first exercise. Then for your second exercise, you have your walking pigeon Get all this stuff out of the way. You're in this high plank. You're here, coming down, coming back up. All right, doing that. What was the other thing I told you to do? Bird dogs. Bird dogs. If you're not doing the walking pigeon, you're doing bird dogs. All right. We got our water. You guys are ready. Starting down, we're starting in three, two, one, go. 
Keeping knees low in that, in that mammalian crawl. There's variations of the bear crawl that we do in here. All right, woo! Switching it out to the pigeon. To the pigeon. The pigeon, the pigeon. Here we go. And walking it through. Arms up. <laughs> Kick off. Get that stretch. Or you're doing bird dogs. Three, two, one. All right. I had an uneven number on that one. So next time I'm going to start with my left leg. Going back into either this turn with crawl, sit outs, or dead bugs. Crawl forward, crawl forward, turn, turn, crawl backwards, crawl backwards. Here we go. All right. I'm going to start with my opposite leg for the pigeon. So funny when we're doing different body movements that we're not used to. Feeling it. Ah, switching it out. Getting that knee in between those palms. Three, two, one. All right, getting ready. Got this. Two, one. Flipping it. Flipping it. Crawl. Crawl. Flipping it. Flipping it. Crawl. Crawl. Ha. Ha. Boom. Boom. Or dead bugs. Dead bugs or sit outs are a fine progression. It's still going to be a total body movement. All right, going into our pigeon. Switching it out. Ha! Should be feeling a nice stretch in those shoulders, in those hips. All right, guys. This is going to be our last set of each one of these. Last set! And we're going. Flip, flip, crawl, crawl. Flip, flip, crawl, crawl. Knees are low in those crawls. All right, that was it. Woo, right? <laughs> Is anybody dizzy from those? Yeah. yeah. Yeah? All right. Here we go, pigeon. Why are that? Why do you have slight concerns that these are my favorite? <laughs> I'm very weird. That's funny. Yeah. All right. Get rest. Get water. We're gonna rest for about a minute and a half, and then I'm gonna go through the next progression of exercises. So I want you to rest. You're either doing. Prisoner squats, or if you have a mini band, you're going to put it around just under your, just over your uh, knees. Then you can do just squats with the band. You can also do jumps, or you can not use the band at all and do jumps. So there's many variations to that. And then you have your glute bridge press. So leave your band on, if you're using a band, laying down on the ground, grabbing your weights, getting those hips up, pull those knees out, push those knees out, and then you're going into your press. Guys, really think about squeezing those shoulder blades together at the back while you're doing those presses, okay? So, 
We're going to get ready to go. Guys, and through a Tabata, if you're feeling super gassed, take one of the rounds out and recover, okay? So we're getting ready to go with our banded squat jumps. Three, two, one, go. Soft, soft landing. And then power up. Woo! If you find your form wavering, just go into a regular squat. Down on the ground for our presses. Two, one, hips up, pushing out on those knees. Squeeze those shoulder blades. Keep those hips up. Your hips are gonna wanna come down, keep them up. Nice, woo! Wow, feeling that constant tension, yeah? Hi, band. Hi. And we're going. Woo! At about 10 seconds of this, I'm like, oh my God. Wow. Three, two, one. What? Oh, burn. <laughs> and we're going. You got this. All right. I'm feeling some pretty intense fatigue in my legs. For this next one, I'm just gonna do squats. I'm not gonna jump with it. Woo! Woo! Ugh. Getting low, getting low. Good job, Sarah. Nice. Nice. All right. Coming back to our presses. Push out on those knees, warriors. Hips up. Josh has just come in in time to torture all of y'all. Woo! All right. Guys, this is our last set of each of these. So last set, whatever, it's fine. Wah! Wah! Okay, four seconds, you got it, you got it. Wah! What? Woo! Jennifer, yeah. I gotta kill you on your last day, right? Yeah. No. <laughs> Stay alive, Jennifer, please. The world needs you. Woo! I don't know about you guys, but my legs are on fire. <sighs> hips up, hips up. All right, what? Well, we don't need those anymore. He, 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 ha, 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 This is my gift to all of you guys. Oh, you don't need that. Actually, anybody who showed up today gets to take this home. Oh, really? So, yeah, yeah. Oh, my God, this is what I always want. I know, and now you just threw it away, so. All right, water, water, water. Yeah, that's more, more coffee. <laughs> she was gonna get a job with like that beach body on TV. Uh, they were like, I'm yelling at Jennifer. <laughs> I know. You're not there, and I'm just yelling at you. 
That would be good. Whoops. My batteries are finally running out of my mic. <laughs> All right. It's fine. I think it, it, usually when it turns red, it lets me go for a little bit longer. All right, guys. Again, you're resting while I am demonstrating. So calf raises. Come up, squeeze, lock out those glutes, lock out those legs so you maintain balance. Don't roll out those ankles, right? Stay in those big toes. Then you're rocking back, bringing those toes up, going back on those heels. And then our sumo bent row. I'm in a deep, deep squat. Press. Arnold press. Thank you. Thank you, Bob. Arnold press. Elbows in, coming out, up. Look at that. Bob's got my back. Thank you. The problem is I can't read my handwriting. So he didn't want to squat right now. That's true. All right. So again, keep those elbows in at your rib cage. Press out. Get those arms long. Keep that rib cage tucked though. Don't bring that rib cage out, right? All right. Let's do it. Let's do it. All right. We're starting with our calf raises, guys. And three. Two, one, hit it. Rock it. Rock it. Yeah, Jennifer. Rocking and rolling with these calf raises. When you lock out those legs, it really, really helps you from falling forward. It's the same thing with those high pulls that we do, those RDL high pulls. All right, Arnold presses. Three, three. Two, one, woo! Are they named after Arnold? They are named after Arnold. Yeah. Uh. <laughs> the Arnold. Yeah. All right, guys. When we go back into our calf raises, if your arms are getting fatigued from holding your weights, drop them for your calf raises. It's fine. You want a little extra something, something? You're gonna hold on to those dumbbells. Yeah? Here we go. Coming up. Woo! Woo! Yeah! Ah! Two! One! Hua! Arnold, give us strength to carry on! <laughs> that is one of his best lines. Yeah. yeah. It is not a tumor. Yeah. Okay, so Jennifer, Kindergarten Cop or Biodome? Which is a better movie? You know, I have to revisit Kindergarten Cop, but I believe that part of that film was filmed in Oregon. Oh, really? Washington. Okay. I don't know. Nice. I remember Mountain You are. Uh, you are full of just needless information <laughs> about really bad movies. <laughs> it's one of the things I love about you. What else is really bad that I just realized? What? Bill and Ted's. Oh. It is bad. No, I like. Love that movie, but it is bad. Oh, no, it is horrible. Bill's, yeah. Bill and Ted's? Yeah. Production quality is like way worse than I remember. All right, guys, going back into our Arnold's. <laughs> yeah, low budget. Good job, Reba. Going body weight. You can totally do body weight with this. Bob, rib cage down, rib cage down. Yeah. Does that make sense? So you're extended right now. I want you to tuck, tuck it. <laughs> and guys, this is our last set of each one of these exercises. Last set. Woo! <laughs> so what's your favorite verse? 90s, 80s, 90s. Oh, um, love potion number nine. And he, oh my God, it's like Sandra Bullock, one of her first movies. Oh my God, it is so bad. It's phenomenal. Two, one. All right. It's, it's actually, I, I would suggest worth, worth watching. I mean, watch yeah. Two, one. Ugh. Coming in. 
All right. Ah. Good one. Yeah, we did that one, guys. Good job. Get water. All right, I'm going to demo again while you're resting, okay? I got so excited to do the sumo bent rows. I wanted to do it last time, the whole time. Single leg walkouts. So you're either doing an inchworm, coming out into that high plank, coming back in, or you're doing a single leg walkout. Come down as low as you can before you start to walk out, bending that knee, keeping that knee low the entire time, and then switching it again out. Again, if you end up on an odd number, just start with that other leg then the next time we go into that part of the circuit, all right? So, got that? Um, oh, guys, my Zoomers, after class, if you could stay on for a second, we wanna take a class picture, okay? So we'll surround you guys on the uh, computer and get a nice class picture, yeah? All right. I think we all <laughs> well, you want to put makeup on first? Yeah. yeah. Josh, can I some makeup? <laughs> ah, ah, ah. Ah, ah, ah. Oh, there you are. All right, guys. Let's get into it. I don't know. Alexa didn't like Girl Talk Radio this morning. She was just like, no, no, I'm not playing that. She, she, she's so used to playing Florence in the Machine in the morning that she's like not playing anything else. All right, so single leg walkouts, guys, or inchworms. And we're going. Get low, get low. Is it illegal to just fall into it? Please don't fall into it. <laughs> Please. I guess I want to pop something on. I didn't think that was Yeah, be careful with those wrists. <laughs> you, 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 need, you need your wrists. All right. <laughs> okay. Yeah, now my sumo bent rows. Right? Boom. Boom. Pushing. Pulling. Ah. Oh. Getting low, getting low. Yeah, yeah. See how you, yeah, 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 yeah. Now get all the way to the ground with the other one. There we go. And then push and pull. Push and pull. Sorry, did I forget to demo that one? No. I did? Woo! So seriously, don't just like lean forward and fall? No, I want you to bring that knee forward and then come into it. There we go, there we go. Yeah. The more you bend your... Yeah, no, the more you bend your knee, the easier it is to get, a bit to get down. And then you just stay low on the way back. All right. That was it. Going back into my sumo bent row. No, it's not the last set. Nobody listen to Jennifer. Nobody listen to Jennifer. Pushing and pulling, pushing and pulling. Nice, Heather. Ah, what? Wow. Yeah. That is a groin burner. What? Three, two, one. Coming down. Walking out. Coming back in. And up. Switching it out. Woo! Coming up. You guys got this. Woo! Yeah? All right. Six. So, okay, so my sumos, widen out those feet. Get low, get low. Pushing and pulling. So, Catlin, see how I'm like actually contact the ground the entire time? Oh. And then I'm, yeah, yeah, I want you to push like that. Yeah. Right? right? Wow. All right, this is gonna be my last set of each. Last set! Last set! Woo! Getting after it!
after it. Woo! High plank, guys, high plank. But it's the same level as the shoulders. All right. Last set of sumos. Groin crushers. <laughs> Milk in the upside down cow. Get it, get it. Groin crushers. Three, two, one. What the what? Woo! All right. Hydrate. Water, water. You didn't even see the first part. All right. Guys, I'm going to demo the next part. You're going to watch. Body saws. Whoops. My favorite, body saws. Body saw, body saw. So I'm coming back on my heels, going over my, my elbows, behind my elbows, keeping that butt at the same level as your shoulders. Military crunch. You want to make it harder? Grab a weight. Boom, coming up. Knees are bent the entire time. All right, let's go ahead and get after it so we have time for our homework. What? More tabata, 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 tomato, tomato. Was that? I, you don't stall me. Don't run out the clock, Sarah. All right, guys, body size. Let's go. Three, two, one. If we have like mimosas, we have time for But down. But down. Get your five foot butt down. <laughs> <laughs> Your five foot butt crack, whatever. <laughs> All right. Never heard that excuse before. No. Never heard that excuse before. No, I just have a big butt. Oh, big butt, but not big butt crack. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> oh, get it, get it. Military crunch, get it. Bob, knees up the whole time. Knees up the whole time. Ah. Oh. <sighs> Yes! Woo! Now we get to rest in our body saws. Ha ha, just kidding. <laughs> so much fun. Does this does this does this point to my psyche and how disturbed I am? That these are all my favorites? Yeah. I had more favorites, but we can only do five sets. It's like a weird combination of strength and mobility. Yeah. And ice holds looking right. <laughs> body saw. Body saw. Get my body saw. Do the body saw. These songs do help. Yeah, songs do help. Uh, well, I'm glad we don't have time for the Moby flower. Oh, God. Uh, like the yeah, have you not done that? No. Where you do squats? I love this. I missed all the days. Is that the bring Sally up song? Yeah, so you're yeah. just squatting when he goes, bring Sally up, yeah. bring Sally down, back into my body size. And then you pause at the bottom. Oh, man. Yeah. Well, there's, you did something called Around the World, and I thought you should do it to that gap song. Oh, yeah. Uh, that song's like seven minutes long. Yeah. <laughs> All right, guys, butt down. Butt down, Heather. Yeah. You're going to feel this in those obliques, guys. All right. Coming up. Ah. 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 Three, two, one. 
Yes. This is my last set of each. Last set. All right. That's it. Thank you. Very hard. Coming back. Those heels getting that nice flexion. Two, one. Woo! <laughs> All right, guys. Last set of military crunches. Get after it. Ah. 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 Yeah. You guys, give me a little bit of rest, just a couple seconds, and then we're going to go into our knee grabs, our mountain climbers, either crossbody or regular, then our push-ups or our archer planks. All right? So grab some water if you want it. Choose your own adventure. If you want to give your abs a little bit of rest, start with uh, push-ups. <laughs> Doesn't matter. You're screwed anyway. You're screwed every way. So I'm going to start with my knee grabs just because it's easy for me to remember doing that. All right. Woo! How are you guys feeling? Good? Yeah! Yeah! You're awake. You're alive. All right. Starting in three. Two, one, go. Catlin, fastest knee grabber on the planet. She's out of the gate. She's out of the gate. No, she's doing a, she's doing a, a, a knee grab a second. It's amazing. <laughs> Two, one. Man, you don't, you didn't even use your tongue that time. It's amazing. I got it. Um, I think you are either tied with Francie. Now I'm doing my archer planks or my push-ups, or you're doing your mountain climbers or your knee grabs, whichever. That's great. That's great. Yeah. Push -ups, push -ups, push -ups, push -ups, push -ups, All right, guys. Next, I'm going to do my cross-body mountain climbers because it's a little bit easier on my hips, but you can do regular or cross-body. Two, go. You got this, you got this. Oh. Thanks. 